Hello guys and welcome to No Makeup Sandy. But today I wanted to show you the Flawless 4 and how it works. It is amazing. So what is the Flawless 4? It begins with your primer, which I have already done. And then you move on to your amazing Liquid Touch Mineral Foundation. Um, applied with the Powder Puff Brush. More on that in a minute. And finished off with your concealer. These four right here will give you the most flawless look ever. Okay, so I wanted to start um, with a red liner. Yes, a red lip liner. Um, I have circles. I have a few acne scars here and there. But overall, I don't have horrible skin. So why not make it a little worse? So we're going to take, you know, we're going to put some polka dots here and there. Like I've got, a, you know, breakouts and this, that, and the other. So there we go. It looks more like the chicken pox, but that's okay. So I've already primed my skin. Let that sit in for two to three minutes. You don't doesn't take much, but you let that soak into your skin. And then what I'm going to do is take my powder brush. Yes, this is the exact same brush I use for my powder. And yes, I use it for my liquid. Why? Because this liquid foundation dries to a beautiful matte powder finish. So it is not going... I love you so much, too. Oh, I love you so much. Um, so it's not going to get gunky if gunky is even a word. So it's not going to get gunky in your powder brush. It's actually going to dry. So what we're going to do is shake this up. And you've seen it before. It comes in a dropper, just like that. And we're going to put... Uh, oh, I ran out. I'm going to put a little smiley face on there. Okay. And then we're just going to tap this into the skin, just like that. Okay, I'm the color satin. I'm actually probably could do cashmere since I'm a little tan, but that's okay. So all we're going to do now is we're just going to buff it into the skin. I love you so much. I love you so much. Oh, goodness. Okay, so we're going to buff that in. I mean, it feels like silk on your skin. Seriously. Do you see the coverage? Five little drops. Like, not even an entire, I mean, I filled that up once and put five dots on this brush. It covered up my acne scarring where I put that red liner. Um, made, and, and look, it's literally my skin, but better. It is such a thin consistency. It's more like airbrushed makeup, and it's going to give you that airbrushed finish. So, that is that. And then all I'm going to do is finish off with a little bit of concealer in a lighter color little dot like that. Can you see that? And I'm just going to put that under both my eyes, just like this. Look how much that itty bitty dot, look how far that went. Okay. Do it in a triangle motion. Bring it down and bring it out to the sides. Just like that. And that little bit went a long way. I didn't even need more than that. I mean, this tube will last me how long with that little bit used? And I do use a lighter color because I do it under my um, under my eyes. You can most certainly get the exact same color as your skin if you have major places on your face that you want to conceal. And just gonna put that in just a smidge. And that is it. That is your flawless four. This dries to a powder finish. You do not even need to finish with powder unless you want to. Sometimes I do. Sometimes I don't. It depends on if I'm going to be out in the heat or not. Um, and if I'm going to sweat. But these four right here, how easy was that? That took two minutes to do my entire face. And all I would do next is blush and bronzer and eyes. And then that's it. And I'm out the door. So how gorgeous is this finish? How amazing is it that it covered all of that redness that I put on my face, my acne scars that I had, covered my circles, covered the little polka dots I put on my face. Oh, amazing, amazing. So I had to share this with you guys. I hope you guys have a fabulous day. We will talk to you later. Bye-bye.